Attend you sons of Neptune that roam the angry seas, and all you jolly sailors bold who are moored from danger free. I ask your kind attention to this sad and doleful tune of the melancholy accident of the Wexford bark Hantoon. The elevating joys of home did o'er our senses steal. John Cullen with his steady hand did safely steer the wheel. Delightfully we viewed her track crowned by the billow's foam as by the gentle breezes our ship was wafted home. It was on the ensuing morning before the dawn appeared. Five and a half not sailing, east, north, east we steered. The wind was in our favour, our happiness to crown, when this cursed British monster on us came bearing down. The signal for all hands on deck immediately did sound, and from his peaceful slumber bowled Captain Nail did bound. He tried his whole endeavour for to save his ship and crew, but this cursed heartless tyrant had split our bark in two. Then the mast came crashing down, likewise each spar and sail, and from the opening gulf below there came a dismal wail. To search for men was fruitless in the boats that put to sea. The angry waves rolled over them and sealed their destiny. Eleven was our good ship's crew, but only seven were found. The other three with Captain Nail were killed as well as drowned. By the rock-bound coast of Portugal their lifeless bodies roll. May he whose hands the waves obey have mercy on their souls. Now to conclude and finish, too far my lines have run. To the captain and his gallant crew, may justice soon be done. And may the perpetrator's lot be on the gallows tree, who tried to send a whole ship's crew into eternity.